Hey friends, welcome to an updated PC setup video. I've been meaning to make this video for a long time. Lots of people ask me questions about it, but I've been so busy streaming lately. So sorry about that, guys. I've been here for, I think it's been three months now. And since the second that I moved in here, I said, I'm going to make you guys a new video when all my gear is in place and it's finally on all in place so this video is going to be more about the visual elements that are in my stream room and i'm going to be describing everything that is here if you guys want to know what is actually inside my pc i am not very good with like the hardware that is inside the computer but it is all in my twitch info down in the info section on my twitch tv slash alinity so you can find it there but I'm going to be talking about all the other gear that I have. Okay guys, so this is the room where I stream and I prefer to stream in the basement because of two major things. First, I like to have a lot of space. I like to play DDR and I like to play just dance and I like to do VR sometimes. So having this gigantic space where I can do whatever I want is amazing. A lot of people think that it's weird that I stream from the basement, but actually for streaming during the day and during the night, it's good for you to have a control light setting where you have absolutely no light coming in. I do have two little windows that I have some um, blackouts that I got from Home Depot. They're called Ready Shade. They're the black Ready Shade. They're very cheap and they're paper and you just like stick them to the top. They're super simple. And I'm gonna show you guys all the lights that I have. So I have some pod lights in every single section of this room there is pod lights. And I actually went, I talked to the developers of the building. I asked them to have them all set up so that I could turn them all in rows separately and off so right now that i'm streaming on this side i don't want any top light where i am streaming because it would give me shade under my eyes and under my nose if i had a light coming from the top so you want to have two things on a stream room you want to have a light that comes in the front of you which i will show you guys um my diva light afterwards and i also have some backlight that i have only on the back of the room that is illuminating the art that i got from some viewers and subscribers that I have on the walls. I also have two secret lab chairs. This one is the Omega, and this one here is the Titan. I'm currently using the Omega because it's the one that fits my size the best. I used the Titan for a while, and although I love the width of the bottom part of it, my feet did not touch the floor. So I am quite short. So yes, the Omega fits my size a lot better. And it actually is more ergonomic. I find it better for sitting down in my chair. Like, like the distance from my chair to the desk is a lot better than it is on the Titan. I have a U-shaped desk that I got from a Canadian store that's called Source of Furnishings. It is really, really nice. I'm pretty happy with it. The quality is amazing. So this is my camera. It's a Canon Vixia cam recorder and I use an Elgato capture card to get the video onto the PC. I have a Diva Ring light and this is the light that I use and I like having this right behind my camera. My microphone is an Audio-Technica 4033A. I got this one just a little bit ago. I used to use the 2035 before for a few years and I gave that one to my roommate. So I upgraded to this one and I'm very, very happy with this new microphone. It is definitely worth the money. My monitors are my main one is a 32 inch Samsung curved and my two side ones are Asus monitors. I think they're like 27 inches somewhere around there. Maybe I don't. Yeah, I think they're 27 inches. This is my stream deck. It is great for commands for stream. It can do so many things. So you can change scenes in OBS. You can turn captures on and off. You can also make audio changes. Um, you can do a few things with alerts. You can type emotes and commands in your chat. You can send tweets. You can open programs. So, so many things. I might make a video on um, how to do all this later and all the things you can do with the stream deck because it is so, so cool. Let me know in the comment section if you would be interested in seeing a video on just my stream deck. My keyboard, my mouse, and my mouse pad are all Steel Series products. My keyboard is an M750. My mouse is a Rival 700. And my mouse pad, I am really not sure. You can find my mouse pad in the side. It just shines LEDs. It's really cute. So I'm going to show you guys. Now that you guys saw what it looks like from the front, people always comment on how I am organized with cords and how you can't see very much cords here but I will show you guys the key is out of sight out of mind it's all behind my monitors so I have it all wrapped in loops with velcro and I have some command hooks behind my monitors to hold it there in place that's about it 
thank you guys for watching um please give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and please let me know in the comment sections what kind of videos you would like to see and love and kisses in the booty love you guys so much thank you for watching <laughs>